Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We're terribly sorry to keep you waiting, but it's been difficult. Uh, it's been an interesting and a very exciting week, and one thing is for certain, the great art of the song recital is alive and flourishing, not only here in Wigmore Street, but throughout the world. We have been deeply impressed with the standard of performances heard right throughout the competition, and we thank all the competitors for giving us such joy through their participation. <laughs> Once again, we're very grateful to the visionary Sir Ralph Cohn and the Cohn Foundation for their extraordinary generosity in financially underpinning this competition. We, we greatly value Sir Ralph and Lady Cohns and their entire family's outstanding contribution to Wigmore Hall, as well as their warm friendship. The musical world owes them a huge debt of gratitude for keeping this competition running over a remarkable 16-year period so far, helping to ensure a vital future for this very, very special repertoire. We have heard 26 singers and 22 pianists since Friday, many accomplished and many promising performers, all winners in their own way. Uh, they have been selected from the initial 170 or so people who uh, applied. Taking part in an international competition is not just about winning. Its purpose is to help or to launch or advance careers as well as providing valuable opportunities for interchange and establishing standards amongst young people who may otherwise be working in isolation across the world. It provides an invaluable opportunity to meet contemporaries and to receive advice and feedback from judges. And all of this was achieved here this week. And more importantly, I'm absolutely convinced that many of the young singers and pianists that we heard even in the early stages of the competition, will go on to have significant careers. We heard some magnificent voices, and particularly to those young singers in your mid to late 20s who didn't make it to the semi-final or the final, please come back next time because that could well be your moment. To you, the audience, the most important part of this competition is to assist in the musical development of these young singers and pianists by broadening their song repertoire and developing their sense of public performance. And without your help, encouragement, and support throughout every stage of the competition, none of this would have been possible. So we're very grateful to the Wigmore Hall audience. I would like to acknowledge and thank my dedicated and very hardworking colleagues on the jury. So please welcome my very favorite Irish dame, Anne Murray. <laughs> Maxine Robertson, who stepped in at 24 hours' notice. Robert Gamble, Graham Johnson, Peter Alfrink, Asador Santorin, and Christoph Pregardian. And a special thank you to Helen Granger and to all of the staff for guiding us and helping us through all the complexities of the event. So, before I announce the various winners, I would like to invite Sir Ralph to the stage to help us present the prizes. So, up you come, Ralph. Thank you. <laughs> Right, the first, uh, the new Richard Tower Prize for the best interpretation of Schubert Leader, kindly sponsored by the Anglo-Austrian Music Society, which will now be presented by Bernard Keefe, Chairman of the Society. The uh, Richard Tauber Schubert Prize is awarded to Timothy Fallon and Emil Bushakovitz. <laughs>
Next, the Jean Meikle Prize for a duo presented in memory of, the G of Jean Meikle Drake, a well-known member of our audience who influenced the early careers of many singers and pianists over the years. And the prize will be presented by her granddaughter, uh, Matilda Uribe. The Jean Meikle Prize goes to Johnny Hereford and William Van. <laughs> William... As you saw, Johnny, Johnny is not here. Uh, his girlfriend took him out for a consolation prize. So uh, that's what we've been told. So William will pass that on, I'm sure. And so to the uh, pianist prize, uh, which goes to Emil Bushakovic. to the main prizes for singers. Third prize goes to Helen Sherman. Second prize to Gavin Ring. And first prize, ladies and gentlemen, to Timothy Fowne. So, thank you everybody. It's been a wonderful few days for the whole. It's been wonderful uh, for, for the song, for the art of the song recital. And we hope to see you all here again in two years' time. Thank you very much indeed.